Hey guys, welcome back. Today I want to, uh, I don't know, introduce or announce, I guess, uh, a group build, um, or at least the idea of one. It's only a group build if people take place in it, take part in it. Um, it's something that uh, I did a couple years ago uh, when the channel, my channel was a uh, 64 scale Hot Wheels and that uh, I did a uh, shop truck build um, basic premise was we all have our shops of sorts and we're building you know die cast with 64 scale die cast and some guys are into trucks cars uh, muscle cars hot rods whatever it may be but uh, what would your shop truck look like to build a truck that would uh, represent your shop and you've seen shop trucks before they can be anything from an old pickup truck that you pick up parts with to a calling card for your shop that you might take to the uh, cruise ins on uh, you know Wednesday night or whatever during the week and custom paint with your with your logo on it um, so this would be the same thing only we're doing it in 25th scale uh, what does your shop truck look like <clears throat> now we've got a few cars here because I mean this is open pretty wide you could haul parts in just about anything so you've got I got a couple of mine that are built here uh, El Camino and a Ranchero uh, pickup trucks you get Chevrolet and then Dodge Ford maybe a little station wagon or a sedan delivery that Pinto something like that um, it's up to you. What does your shop use to haul parts around in? Um, excuse me. Bump that there. So, uh, yeah, pickup trucks, uh, El Caminos, Rancheros, vans, sedan deliveries, uh, station wagons, box trucks. There's all kind of stuff you could use. Um, I think on this, uh, because I was a little apprehensive, I wanted to do this before, but there are so many builds going on, um, I don't really, really want to step on uh, the toes of other guys that they're doing challenges or builds and, and group builds and such. And, uh, you know, I didn't realize everybody's time is uh, important. <clears throat> so what I thought I would put this out there, if anybody, you know, is interested We'll start April 1st, uh, Friday, April 1st is April Fool's Day. You have uh, the rest of March to decide, hey, do I really want to do this? What do I have? Do I have something in the stash? Do I buy something? Um, kind of get your thoughts together on what shop truck you have or what you would want uh, to build for your shop truck. Uh, and then we're just going to take it through the end of the year. That's nine months you know, we can produce a, a, a human being in nine months. We should be able to uh, pop a shop truck out in nine months. Um, so the only rules would be 25th scale or 24th. You know what I mean? 20, right there, 24th, 25th or 24th scale. Plastic. Uh, no die cast. Uh, it'd be a you know kit. You're putting it together. Stay away from uh, pro promos unless you're using the body uh, or parts of a promotional model. Um, resin kits, resin parts, that's all good. Um, photo etch, you know, any aftermarket. It can be box stock. It can be as detailed as you want. It's your, it's your truck. It's your shop. So uh, what we'll do is we'll we'll let. We'll let y'all think on this, um, and we'll see how things go as uh, March progresses, uh, and uh, there may be some tweaking to it, uh, but uh, we'll just, you know, as of right now, we'll think that uh, April 1st, Friday, April 1st, would be the official start, um, and, you know, say any anything that you would haul parts in is okay. All right, guys. That's it for today. I uh, hope everyone's having a good weekend, and uh, we'll talk to you next time. 
Thanks for stopping by.